For me, it's really exciting to know that there is a proper education in the nature of intelligence, that it's available, and it's so available that anyone can get it really quickly and easily and with great fun and ease, like we've done here in the last three months or four months, and also all over the world. It's so easy that it's unbelievable almost uh, how easy it is to get to know ourselves as open intelligence educate ourselves in the nature of mind something that was totally complicated before you know even just sometimes thinking about the mind or or the term open intelligence for me immediately in the past there was a, a a picture of a mountain somewhere remote where you need to walk and little mushrooms where maybe i can find some hidden treasures of maybe a recognition of something and then also I will need to learn a new language and of course I need to be a man in order to receive this opportunity to be educated in the nature of mind and now really without any effort just with great openness we have everything that is available to us complete education in the nature of mind with no nothing misleading, nothing, nothing in the way for you to gain complete assurance and confidence in your nature as a benefit creator. All of us, we have amazing capacity to be of benefit. This is our birthright, this is the most basic human right. You can shout forever about many rights and human rights, but there's nothing more basic than getting to know ourselves as we truly are, what, 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 how we work, how we operate, what, what is What's going on here, basically? Something I ask myself since I could ask questions. So, in balanced view, we call this nature of mind, this basis of all experiences, we call it open intelligence. And to get to know it, you stop thinking for a moment and see what remains. A sense of alertness, cognizance, open intelligence remains. This is it. You might want to complicate it, but there's no need to complicate it because it's not a special state. I'm sorry to disappoint some people who might be still seeking a special state, but it's not a special state. It's a state that is always on and it includes all states. And then we have, when we stop thinking for a moment, we recognize this stability, clarity, cognizance, what we call open intelligence, and then, of course, all of our thoughts, emotions, and sensations, they jump in. Like, for example, it's really hot, I know it already, I have stomach pain, oh, why did I eat the periphery? I don't know if you know you call it, the sweet in the breakfast. How do you call it? <laughs> exactly. Something <laughs> roll. And, um, you know, it's too sweet or... Wow, I'm so arrogant and prideful, I wish I was married, uh, you know, <laughs> an entire display of uh, data streams, an entire display of complete um, dynamic energy, you know, one of the first things we start to see is that uh, what we call data streams, are, they are simply the dynamic energy of open intelligence, simply the dynamic energy of open intelligence, simply the dynamic energy of your own open intelligence, nothing else, and they are inseparable from open intelligence. Like the color blue in the sky, we can't separate them, we don't even want to do that, it doesn't make sense. Same with our, all of our experiences and open intelligence. So once we know that, we can enjoy freedom in immediacy of perception, regardless of what the perception is. And this is what we come back to in short moments of open intelligence, repeated many times, until it becomes continuous. The instinctive recognition of open intelligence becomes continuous day and night. So no longer for me, like all the special states that I was looking after, uh, and I was really desperate to, to stay there and hold on to them, now it's like, okay, that was funny, that was interesting, lots of fun, lots of local buses in India, lots of hopes and fears, but once I have the opportunity and the education to know that it's available for me in every given moment, one moment at a time, gain, you know, it's quite simple again. So that's what I choose in every moment, to rely on open intelligence rather than emphasize my data streams, whether they are good, bad or neutral.
they are all equal appearances of open intelligence, like appearances in a crystal ball, for example, like the crystal ball reflects everything equally, right? Like it's pristine and all the appearances are in inseparable from it. So you have a good appearance, the crystal ball doesn't go and analyze why it's there. It continues on and reflecting everything equally, the bad and the neutral as well. Everything is the dynamic energy of benefit. This is how we learn to be, that's how I learned to be or to come to terms with my innate capacity to be of benefit, my deep wish. All of my life I wanted to be of benefit. I just didn't have the education, you know, like all of my life I wanted to learn Spanish. I didn't wait and hoped for some day that Spanish will dawn at me, on me. I took a Spanish book and I started to learn. I talked with other people who are speaking Spanish. I listened to talks in Spanish and now I know a few words in Spanish. Hola. <laughs> so, you know, same like when we take something so basic as education in the nature of mind, thinking that we'll do something and maybe it will reach to us, it's very primitive. But if we take a stand and we take, you know, just be powerful and stand up and say, okay, you know, I admit, didn't know about this education in the nature of mind. Now I want to know about it. Can you support me? And the answer is yes. You can totally be supported by the Four Mainstays lifestyle. It's not like, oh yes, maybe, but please change this kind of negative data and come back to us next year when you are fixed. <laughs> no. It's actually, wow, yeah, great. Are you open for that? Are you ready? Are you ready to see everything fully? And we are there to support you in every given way, in every, in every possible way. So this is my experience over the last six years of knowing the balanced view training and actually taking a stand and saying, okay, I lived in a primitive way and I don't want to harm myself anymore and I don't want to harm anyone else anymore. And now I'm going to start and educate myself with the four mainstays of balanced view. It's very cool and so simple, really, like the Spanish example. Ooh, when will it come? Just go ahead and do it, you know. Put yourself in an environment where people are relying on open intelligence. I wouldn't go to the place you just described. It sounds like a potential nightmare. <laughs> so I would definitely tr try to be in a place where I'm accepted, I'm loved totally, I'm respected for everything I have. People want to know my strengths, gifts and talents and there is openness for me to contribute them. Otherwise, I won't be there. And in California, we have an amazing community, so we can share with you some details. Open hearts, open minds, and maybe a bed or two for you to be there. That's the life of the four mainstays. <laughs> really, I'm traveling all over the world. You know, I have the best, the best, I don't know, even to call it job will be weird because I don't feel like it's a job. I'm moving gracefully <laughs> with the community all over the world, meeting people who are open like a cloudless sky, choosing to devote their life for the benefit of all, and, and sharing my experience about it and working on amazing projects. And I see it everywhere. It's not just here in Goa and it's not just in Israel. And there is a community in Israel. Yesterday I met 15 of them via live stream and beautiful you know like in Sweden we have an amazing center with lots of lakes and and green gardens organic gardens and lots of text and education in the nature of mind and beautiful people who will support you so for me I chose not to compromise even one more second of my life I know where my power is and I'll do everything to support it to shine because all of us, we deserve to shine every moment, not just sometimes when there is good weather and nice data streams. Shine all of the time, really. And if you are up for it, everything is available for you to experience it. And being in an intimate relationship, also there, the context of the relationship changed completely. From, uh, I can share my experience, from being a victim of my data streams and then of course I need to victimize my partner because I'm a victim of my data streams. Now it doesn't work like that. I see her, my partner, my beautiful partner, as a completely empowered human being. And I don't want to change anything about her. Even the annoying things that jump, you know, sometimes in a couple, 
it, they still jump up, by the way. They still appear. They're annoying things that you don't like. Like, for me, something that really annoys me is that, uh, <laughs> is that the light I is turned on in the shower after the shower is complete, you know? <laughs> it used to drive me crazy. <laughs> now I take a few short moments, I state my view in a loving way, and I go to the switch and I turn it off. Wow. <laughs> Practical wisdom in every given moment. You know, before it would be okay, mm, she's doing it again. She's probably doing it to annoy me. Anyway, I had such a bad day and I woke up with, with negative data streams like I, I do in the last 30 years. So why the world is so miserable and why, why there's no peace in the Middle East? And whoa, oh, whoa, well, relax, take a short, <laughs> you know, take a short moment and see the pristine space within everything, which includes and contains everything, <laughs> subsume all data, all negativity as well. I'm like a walking experiment of total negativity, shining forth, negativity galore, every, every possible data. You know, you would arrest me if you know what I have in my mind right now. You know, it's really so negative that I don't know how I can continue to live life like that. But with the Four Mainstays, I'm like, I don't really care which data appears, it, it appears for me, it really doesn't matter. For me it's the commitment, the moment-to-moment -moment commitment to be empowered and not to live as a victim anymore. And then you can have n any negative state or positive state, it really does not matter. So a life of waiting for positive states, it's a bad joke. <laughs> I tried to do some southern uh, accent there, <laughs> didn't work. That's how bad it is, <laughs> you know? It's a bad joke. <laughs> and then we shared, there was a question also about all the ism and belief systems and ism, ism, that, and nihilism and spiritualism and communism. And these are belief systems and assumptions and you can say belief systems and assumptions are data streams shining forth within open intelligence. If we are ignoring the source of them, open intelligence, they will be very limiting. They, w they will be just ideas that we somehow convinced ourselves that they are reality. But in reality, the reality that really works and clarifies all confusion and all nice ideas and all belief systems is open intelligence. So for me also, I had many isms stuck in my mind. I thought they were stuck in my mind. Yeah. I was born, uh, born in this way with many idealism. Ism. And after doing the 12 empowerments, which is, uh, I don't know even how to call it, like this genius, incredible training that if you, do, you don't do it, I'm really, wow, I can't believe why you don't do it. And, uh, <laughs> you know, that would be my, my take on that. Um, all of my belief systems were clarified, even the ones that I took to be totally myself, like being a vegetarian, for example. This, w this was my most emphasized data stream, being a vegetarian. And nothing wrong with it, and I, did, I still don't eat meat, I, I admit, but the, all the tension around it and the hate and arrogance, I can't find them anymore. But what I'm clarifying is the benefit of all starts to be the case in every given moment. What will be of most benefit to all? No longer emphasizing a separate identity. This is deadening, it's boring, and it's devitalizing. To emphasize a separate identity that needs to reach some kind of a special state or special career, special life circumstance. I mean, look, look, look at us, how brilliant we are. What we achieved this season together, so many new people came to know the training. So many people who already have been involved in the training have the opportunity to, to recognize even more open intelligence in their everyday life. I feel so empowered, like I came here a certain way three months ago, now I feel like a totally, wow, totally empowered human being. I was before as well, but now it's like upgraded a million times, like I can't even believe it just by being in the Four Mainstays environment. Short moments is the first mainstay. The training itself, which is unending trainings, inexhaustible benefit, treasures, golden texts and that elicits and evokes the inst instinctive recognition or MP3s or videos. The trainer is someone who is there to support us completely with no hideouts. 
and the community of Balance You, which is us here and all over the world. There are thousands of people enjoying this recognition. So my heartfelt advice from experience of six years is really to immerse yourself as much as possible because this is what works. Thinking about open intelligence will not work, sorry friends, it will not work to intellectualize the nature of reality. It will not work and it never worked to anyone. So if you are ready, there is something that really works for everyone. And ask the people who are sitting here and ask them, how is it? How is it for you and how do you rely on the four mainstays? And how is to live a life without any complication whatsoever? In confusion, there's no confusion. In doubt, there is no doubt. In lack of recognition of open intelligence, there is no lack of recognition. Freedom in immediacy of perception. Freedom for the benefit of all.